So this is the game between Shaurya versus Vyan. We are seeing this game. Shaurya starts with e4. And Vyan played e5. Knight f3. Knight c6. Bishop c4. Development. Development. Here, uh, Italian opening. Knight c3. Knight f6. d3. Castle. Castles. Now this is the, you know, not the right move. Because uh, you are not following the opening principle. What is written in the opening? Don't move any single. Don't move twice. any single piece twice unnecessarily in the first ten moves. Right. So this is unnecessary. Here you have to just simply play either uh, d6 or h6. H6 to stop this bishop g5, or d6 to open the bishop so the bishop can come out. Okay. Simple as that. But uh, yeah, he played this one. Not good. And you captured correctly, very good white capture, knight cross or d4. You're getting a bishop for a knight, that's a good trade. So yes, knight cross d4 is okay. Bishop uh, e3 is fine, h3 also was there, but this is fine. And uh, he played it back. Now, actually there was a support, so no need. You could continue like c6, d5 or something. Or even d6 was okay. But uh, yeah, moving the same piece again and again unnecessarily is not good. So this is another mistake. h3, okay, good. Instead of h3, you could even play f4 uh, to open everything, the rook and uh, attack directly. Because now you are having very good lead in the development. Once you have development lead, then you are supposed to open the position like this. Okay, f4 exchange and then your all pieces are ready to go, ready to attack on this king side. But anyway, h3 is not bad. Uh, d5 is a bad move, very bad, because uh, not seeing the attack supports, total attack, total support, you have to count. How many attacks are there? There are three attacks, two supports, not good. You're not supposed to do that. This is the basic thing you have to understand when you want to move something somewhere, you have to calculate total attack, total supports on that particular square. Three attacks, two supports, you can't play that. If you want to capture the same thing, you have to do total attack, total support, you have to see. So, this was uh, bad. After that, yes, white captured correctly, e cross, or actually knight cross d5 was better because once you have extra point, what are you supposed to do? Exchange more pieces. Mm -hmm. So you have a chance to exchange more, that's better. Right? If you take with the pawn, the knight will move and you can't exchange more pieces. And the pawn also will be double unnecessarily. You don't have to make double pawn. So this was okay move, but knight cross d5 was better. Knight attacking the bishop, okay. Uh, no need to do this actually. Uh, because here you have a support. Instead, you could play f4 or some other move. Anyway. Uh, c6 attacking the bishop, but now he can just say uh, exchange, and that's good for white. Uh, this one, okay, b cross, knight cross, c6 was also there. Now, this knight is not good huh? in the corner, doing nothing in the side. See, he cannot come out this side. So, better you should have captured with the knight instead of the pawn. So, queen d7, not that good again. Queen f3 is okay. Uh, rook d8, okay, trying to develop at least, not very bad, but yes, uh, rook uh, here, b8 or uh, rook e8 was okay. So b4 attacking that, you had to move, and then, yes, you captured very nice, correctly. Uh, the queen has to move, actually, queen c7 was needed to save the knight, but uh, he moved on the wrong square, so this knight is having only one support and two attacks are there. No, you missed that. See, you are getting free thing you, you don't know. Actually, b5 was also okay because this knight is not going anywhere. You don't need to give that. And uh, yeah, anyway, let's see. Here, the problem was if, he, if you capture this, no? Uh, he could capture after bishop cross b7, bishop cross b7, queen cross b7, uh, a6 or rook b8, all these moves are there, which was still good for you. Anyway, you played this knight here, then uh, yeah, this was the move where white played knight b5 attacking, but then this has no support now. So, black captured it correctly. 
and no uh, a3 played actually knight c7 was looking good but anyway let's let's see a3 attacking this uh, rook f d1 instead of b1 b1 was better but uh, okay then this one getting it out but what about this one okay black just forgot about the support to that knight and uh, this is the mistake now again you are getting free thing why are you not capturing uh, because you think this is uh, the problem but then you will get one okay so this was not needed you need don't need to attack this okay you first get whatever you are getting free okay this was a bigger mistake actually he forgot about the attack on the queen so yes uh, thank you so and much attack on the rook right right now to both the rooks are attacked yes, yes, yes. everything is lost and yes it was easy checkmate afterwards Okay, so that was a very good game. Uh, white played quite well. Yeah, black made few mistakes, and after that, it was wrong. But in the opening, he also played good. No problem. So uh, learn from these mistakes, and next time you have to play better.